welcome to the CDEM30 conference for e-democracy and open government. I'm glad you all managed to come here. Thinking about new ways of engaging people to help with decision making. But for the most part, government still looks like this. And they would say, we open that code and everything is going to be great. Democracy is going to be renewed. Of course, you know, it didn't happen. If I had to say my, what I'm optimistic about is the potential change that bringing together communities, researchers, um, people uh, uh, to engage in democratic processes to create new forms of government, uh, new forms of governance, and also new ways of thinking about how we solve our community challenges. Being open doesn't mean being equal, and most of the trends that I see from a power shift is that the power is centralized in the hands of few, and that bothers me. Too many expectations that are not managed followed by a total disillusionment and undermining any belief on what a democracy is capable of. We have institutions that are evolving towards a readiness and a willingness to work with people. So that engagement isn't simply an ideal, uh, but is actually a way in which institutions come to work. Again, not because it makes for just for better democracy, but it actually makes for a better way of solving problems that serves the interests of the institutions and of the public. We've had the CDEM uh, three times, 2011, 12 and 13. Uh, we've been asking our keynotes questions about the topics to be discussed 2018, so we'll be around another five years. Yeah, and um, we are very proud that um, this year we have such brilliant keynotes. Yeah. Yeah. And you know what's interesting? I asked the keynotes this year exactly the same questions I asked the keynotes five years ago. So we should compare and contrast and see how things are changing. Yeah, good idea.